there is a huge lack of information around anal sex. The healing effects of butt love. Hi, I'm Mariah Freya, sex coach and co-founder of Betucated. This video is about the anal orgasm, the back door to heaven. Yes, butt love feels to me so earthy and vital. My instinct is filled with, yeah, perhaps a little bit of fear in the beginning, but once I personally relax and breathe through it, I connect to this animalistic side in me. It's like a clap of thunder going from down below upwards, earth-shakingly strong and intense. Yeah. So let's look where exactly is it? Well, know your anatomy and check out your anus, right? I recommend to simply take a mirror and take a good look. It appears tight and small, but it's actually capable of stretching enough to accommodate a finger, toys and a penis as well. The anus is filled with nerve endings and it's a great pleasure source for everyone. At the top of the anus is the rectum. It's not as sensitive as the anus, but some women enjoy the fullness that it creates during anal play. So discover your perineal sponge, the PS spot, which lies between the vagina and the rectum. It's actually just beneath the perineum, that band of skin between the vagina and the opening of the anus. The perineal sponge is a mass of erectile tissue. That means when you stimulate it, when you're turned on, it fills with blood and becomes engorged, just like a man's penis or a woman's clitoris during arousal. What does science say about anal orgasm? Not much to be honest, but I recently read that a recent poll showed that 100% of men and 94% of women say they orgasm during encounters in which they received anal sex or anal play. Quite interesting stuff, right? So what does Tantra say about anal sex? Well, Anal play isn't very popular in the tantric communities. Some sources, especially more the conservative side, claim that butt love weakens the anal and pelvic muscles and may also lead to a certain energy loss that they usually always worried about. I personally believe as long as you stay present and aware with your body and boundaries, you cannot hurt yourself. And again, the anus is stretchable. By the way, I'm noticing a growing number of body workers and also practitioners working with anal de -armoring. So it seems to grab the attention towards this pleasure organ more and more. And how can men experience this too? Well, the anal play for men can be tremendously liberating. Firstly, to overcome all of the homophobic beliefs that has been planted into men's heads for centuries which creates only pain and suffering towards the male gender. Secondly, same as for women, men have a tremendous orgasmic nerve system inside their butt. It has the potential to experience deep and different kinds of orgasm. You can actually discover the male chi spot, which is the area around the prostate with anal play. And to get deeper into that, check our video about the prostate massage. So how to experience this? When you feel ready and open to try anal sex with your partner, make sure to check these five things. So first of all, communicate and relax. Talk about your fears openly and decide on the process on how you are going to do it. Then take it easy and come back to your breath whenever you need support in relaxing. The most crucial aspect is trust. It's the basis for anal sex. If you trust, you can relax, which is truly the key here. Slowness is another very, very important aspect. So take it real slow. Take enough time to warm up, maybe have even vaginal sex or really feel turned on before you're heading into anal sex. Then penetrate very, very slowly. So one important note here I want to make is to be clean. You'll have to feel clean in order to be able to relax, of course. And I think one of our biggest fear, frankly, is to literally hit the shit. 
So, which of course is understandable. And to feel physically and mentally clean, you can, for example, use an enema bulb, which is great for cleaning the inside and outside of the anus. For an extra mental cleanliness, I recommend a condom or a finger condom. This really does wonders to get rid of the shitty thought factor. Another truly important ingredient for anal sex is lube. There cannot be too much lubrication during anal sex. I hope you enjoyed this video and got some new insights about your back door to heavenly pleasures, your anus. Make sure to check out other videos on this orgasm type series and of course, if you're still here with me, make sure to subscribe to our channel for more take to bed inspiration. Thank you so much and bye for now.